Never mind. Two Utah Raptors down there. And there's one approaching to the right. As you can hear. Welcome back to the Hunter Primal. And you know what? I'm actually feeling pretty good going into this episode. And the reason is the last few were pretty intense. We had three terrifying T-Rex encounters. So, I mean, this episode can't be that bad, all right? The game has to throw quite a lot at me in this episode to make it even comparable to the previous ones. But after the last death, I did do another pull. And as you can see, it came down to the wire. All right. But the pistol did end up winning through all the votes. And I mean, we get a head start, I guess. That's good. I only gave myself 10 bullets, which I mean, I kind of wish I gave myself more. That is not a lot. And I also went with the lowest grade camo. And we also have a machete. We spawned right next to a box. So, I mean, this is a good start right off the bat and as you can see that skull icon is a previous death i just had to you know jump off a cliff just to make sure i could respawn with the gun and everything so that's why that's on there but i mean i, de I definitely don't plan on dying okay we've had two deaths in the last three episodes which it's not good we do have a low grade health canister but yeah i mean it is raining and i'm pretty sure it's yeah, it's 3 in the morning, so it's still pretty late at night, or I guess early in the morning, but... Oh god, and the thunder's coming in. You know what? I'm still feeling good, okay? I'm not gonna let this ruin the mood. I'm still feeling good, but yeah, I really want to kill a T-Rex after all those experiences, okay? A T-Rex will go down, but as you can see, um, not right now, because I only have a pistol, but... A lot of the good loot I find is on top of the volcano, so I think we're going to make a quick trip up there. And, I mean, if the journey goes well, I'll see you there in two seconds. And here we are. Surprisingly, nothing happened. The only thing I actually heard was a Utah Raptor, and it was just one. But I didn't even get to see him, so... I mean, honestly, a very quiet journey. And, wow, some awesome gear. Look at that, man. We already found a shotgun. So, I mean... Technically, the pole is kind of useless, but don't worry. I'm still going to use the pistol. Okay, it is still a handy sidearm. Oh, I think it's in this building, maybe on the top floor. Man, I wish there was more of these out in the world because I'd be hiding in them often. Okay, so we now have four low-grade health canisters, some better gloves. So yeah, all around pretty good. I'm heading down now, but... I'm just trying to figure out where to go next. I'm definitely not going down there. That's T-Rex Valley. And we are going to go there eventually, okay? Once I get the gear to kill a T-Rex, I want to slay one of them in T-Rex Valley. I think that'll be fitting. But for now, I'll see you at the bottom of the volcano. As I was making my way down the volcano, I had a very long think about everything that happened recently. And I've come to the conclusion that in the next episode or two, a T-Rex is going to go down. Okay, I don't care what happens, but I'm going to slay a T-Rex, all right? In order to prepare for this, okay, we're going to do two things. One, I'm going to look out for some loot. I don't know what landmarks are nearby, but I'm just going to head off into this direction towards these mountains. And hopefully we find something good, but the other thing I'm going to do is we're going to slay some dinos on the way, okay? It's not going to be a T-Rex, I can say that much, but... We have to practice. Oh, here we go. I've got some tracks. It's a pretty old track, though, so... I'll still follow it, but... I doubt he's in the area anymore. There's a Quetzal nearby, though. So I wonder if I can bait him by throwing a rock just in the air. I mean, I doubt it did anything, but... I gotta say that was a decent throw. Okay, so the Quetzal is attacking me, I think. So, I'm going to use the pistol. I do not want to waste any slug shells. Here we go. We got him. It's going to be a lot harder to hit the shot, so obviously, since it's a pistol, but we're going to try. We did get him once. I don't know where exactly. It looked like the wing, maybe. Oh, my God. He just juked me out completely. Okay, that was a, a very risky shot, and I didn't hit it. Here we go. Come on. Okay, so you know what? We're going to switch to the shotgun, okay? Do not miss. We didn't miss. And he sounds hurt. The problem is it's probably going to fly away now, so I'm going to see if I can shoot him. 
I don't think I hit him. Should I try? I'm gonna give it one shot, alright? I doubt I hit him, but I just wanted to do that. Which is kind of stupid because I'm pretty sure, yeah, we wasted already half of our pistol bullets. You see that Triceratops down there? I don't know, man. I'm having some mixed feelings right now. You know, it's like... I could go for it. We could get some practice. It'll be good for us, but... At the same time, what if we waste ammo and it ends up running away or killing us? You know, that's a very big possibility right there, so... I don't know. I'm currently weighing my options. I think I'm just gonna go for it. Okay, here it comes. Oh, no. Did I spook it? I think I spooked it. Here we go. Here. I don't know, man. That could have been bad. That could have been good. I don't know. Just try not to die. Obviously, I don't even know why I have to say that. Of course, we're going to try not to die. I kind of wish I switched to the slug, but it's too late now. Nope, nope, nope. Ah, uh, not good. Not good at all. That is definitely not good. Nope, not the... Oh my god, what am I doing? What am I doing, man? Okay. We gotta juke him out, or we're dead. Juke! Yes. Get him. Please, uh, tell me the poison is... Okay, we're out of shotgun shells. I don't know, man. I don't know, should I shoot him? I don't think there's a point. That's exactly what I said. I said that it was gonna run away. I was gonna end up wasting ammo, and I still did it anyway, so... There's really no excuse for my stupidity. It's just... Yeah, that was... Okay, whatever, you know what? We can't win every battle. We also just ran out of health canisters, so that's another thing. So, you know what? Let's just go to a landmark and get some more ammo, because I just wasted a shit ton. The least the game can do is give me a box, so... I mean, I'm pretty thankful for that. I'm just hoping it gives us some ammo, a health canister, just not arrows, okay? That's the one thing I don't want, or a bow, okay? I mean, I guess it would be a good backup weapon, but let's just see what we find. But we also have two boxes now, so, I mean, there's got to be something good in one of them. Okay, so we're coming up on the first box. Come on, game, I need something. One pistol bullet. Um, You know what? I'm that desperate that I'm actually kind of happy we found one pistol bullet. As you can see, we have three in total. You know what? That's good. Okay, we also have 308 ammo, just in case we find a rifle. Five low-grade health canisters. Awesome. And there is a landmark up here, which usually gives you... I think it only gives you arrows and bows. So, I mean, you know what? Like I said, we're pretty desperate, so I'm going to check and see what we get. I do see another Triceratops, but you know what? My ego is already destroyed, okay? I do not want any more blows to it. All right, another failed hunt. It's just gonna, it's gonna ruin me mentally. So I'm just gonna let that Triceratops go. And yeah, let's see what we get. Here we are back at probably my least favorite landmark. I mean, as you can see, we're probably not gonna, yeah, we get a bow. Which, I mean, if we run out of pistol bullets, I will switch to it. So I guess it's pretty good. But yeah, this is probably my least favorite landmark. Yeah, you're kind of guaranteed to get stuff that isn't as good okay so i heard a utah raptor up ahead and i'm also gonna eat these eggs screw the negative 10 percent camo because i'm gonna take this utah raptor out okay i've had way too many failed hunts in this episode i think i see him yeah you see him down there walking along my is it 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 okay it does sound like there's more but I think it's just two. I hope it's just two, but... I'm gonna start with the shot. And I uh, completely missed. I see him. Okay, we got him. Switch to the bow. Oh, this is stupid. This is so stupid. Okay, okay. I'm gonna... Pull out the shotgun here. Let him charge. Come on. Damn it. Not good. Not good at all. No way. Yes. Awesome. Okay. We only have three shotgun shells. Wow, they uh went pretty quickly. I thought we had more. I'm going to see if I can take him out with the bow. And I'm not doing a good job at that. Yes. Oh my god, that is the shot we needed. That was the shot I was trying to land this entire time. Oh my god, why is this Triceratops? 
coming in. Like, come on, dude. I need the money. Let's grab this real quick. I'm not going to be able to... Well, that doesn't surprise me. They're straight up dicks. And I think there's another Utah Raptor I just heard. Okay, you know what? So there's something about me that I have not shown or displayed. Oh, God. Okay, we're going to have to take this guy out. Yes. Amazing. But what I was saying there, we have to retreat from this area because all these dinosaurs are going to probably end up killing me, especially since we have barely any ammo. So there's something I haven't told you about. I also think I hear another Utah Raptor. But the thing I'm trying to say is I have sonic DNA in my system. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to sprint to these woods and yeah, I'll show you what I mean. Never mind. Two Utah Raptors down there. And there's one approaching to the right. As you can hear. Okay, yeah, this is... Um, this is just... Not good. Okay, maybe I can throw a rock that did not... Oh, wait. That did distract this Utah Raptor. He's not the brightest. Oh, God. Dude, I... I want to choke that Quetzal to death. I'm telling you, man. Okay. I think they're investigating the rock. Leave me alone, please. Please, dude, please. Okay. We have one arrow left, and we have one slug shell. We do not have a lot of places to hide. I don't feel like hiding in one of these bushes is going to be a good idea, so what I'm going to try and do is ignore this Quetzal flying around being a dick, as always, and we're going to hide in these woods. Okay, I'm hoping maybe there's a tree we can hide in. Or maybe some dense foliage. I'm going to throw a rock off in this direction. The good thing is, as I was climbing the volcano, I was collecting a decent amount of rocks. So we have five in total. Oh, God. They are very close. Dude, we are so screwed. Nope. Oh, my God. I hit the tree. Dude. We do not have enough rocks to be messing up like this, okay? I'm going to throw one down there, and I'm going to save these last two. Oh my god, I hit that tree. This is just... I, I'm pretty sure we should just lie down and take it at this point. You know what? Yeah, this is... We're, we're just gonna have to hide here. Okay, we got a little bit of foliage going on. We have a few trees. But yeah, this is... I also hear Triceratops nearby. Dude, this is not good. One of them is very close. Pretty sure it's walking directly this way and there's also a triceratops right behind us we just have to crawl away i'm thinking there's like five utah raptors maybe four if we're lucky that's minimum it's four minimum utah raptors in the area so i'm just really hoping we survive this because for some reason i doubt we can take out oh my god i forgot you can't prone with the bow why come on game why is that a thing but yeah for some reason i don't think we can take out four Utah Raptors with one slug shell and one arrow. It's just... I don't think that's a possibility. This is not how I want to die, man. I do not want to be torn to shreds by a pack of Utah Raptors. That does not sound like a good way to go. Doesn't sound pleasant at all. But I think we may have lost them. Oh, God. Uh, why is that Triceratops running? I'm pretty sure that can only mean one thing. And, uh... That is, it saw a T-Rex. Dude, it's still running. Maybe, I wonder if it's the Triceratops we shot in the beginning of the episode, and maybe it's still scared of me, but... I mean, it didn't even see me when it started running. It was running down this hill, so I'm kind of scared that there's a T-Rex on the other side of it, but I have to go this way because the Utah Raptors are still on my trail. I do see the Utah Raptor now, but it looks to be the only one, so... I mean, I, I think we can do it. All right, we only have one slug shell and one arrow, but we also have this machete. So, I mean, we may have to rely on it. I'm just going to try and get a one-shot kill here. Yeah, let's just do this. All right, he's coming in. We have to be smart about taking the shot. Okay, like this. That wasn't smart at all. We just missed the place I was trying to aim. Here we go. And uh, I'm a complete moron. Okay. We gotta go. Machete. Mode. Okay. I don't know how much 
damage the machete does, but I actually cut him up pretty good there. There goes the Utah Raptor. Yeah, he just really wanted nothing to do with me. But the way up to the volcano is over here, and I'm not going to risk my life going after that Utah Raptor, okay? It is definitely scarred for life by now, so, I mean, if it finds any of its Utah Raptor friends, they will know not to mess with me, so... I mean, that's a plus, I guess. Okay, so as I was climbing the volcano, look at what I found. That Utah Raptor has died. But I'm not even going to risk it going down there and getting the money. It's not worth it. Okay, at least I got the satisfaction of killing him. My ego has definitely been boosted after this episode because it's, it's definitely in pieces, okay? I already have a fragile ego, but after this episode, it's just... Yeah, it's bad but i do have a plan and i'll tell you that once i get to the top of the volcano oh dude that's awesome look at that the boxes have respawned so it seems like if you go far enough away from the landmarks the loot does respawn after a while okay riot shotgun i'll definitely take that i mean that's an automatic shotgun so that'll come in handy we also have six buckshot shells so pretty good and we also have some better pants and a shotgun sight. I have to say that was a very brutal episode. Not too many good things happened at all. But like I said, I do have a plan, okay? And I realized if I record every time I play, this will end up being a 50 episode series until I actually end up killing a T-Rex. So what I'm going to do is off camera, I'm going to play, get a bunch of gear. And once I feel like I'm confident enough to take a T-Rex out, I'll start recording. I won't kill a T-Rex before then, obviously, but I want to gear up, okay? And I don't want it to be 500 episodes until I get the gear to kill a T-Rex, so that's what I'm going to do. So I'll see you in the next episode when we're hopefully fully kitted out and ready to take on a T-Rex. See ya. Okay, so I'm pretty hurt. Okay, so I'm pretty sure I just heard some sort of... All right, so I'm pretty sure I just heard some sort of dinosaur noise i didn't get a good listen oh my god fucking vocabulary man